Hello and welcome to the 31st video in this series of videos programming Chess Engine in C. So in the last video we generated the, or wrote the code for generating white pawn moves. And in this video I've mirrored this position as you can see on the board here in Arena exactly so that we can now generate the black pawn moves. And this will be quite a bit shorter than the previous video because it's simply, we're going to copy and paste the code in and just change a couple of the values so the directions are different. First thing, however, I'm going to do actually is in Vice, I'm going to take this position, the white position, copy it, put pawn moves W and pawn moves B for white and black, and put a pawn moves B here to pass the black F F E N, and then I'm just going to go into Arena and copy F E N to clipboard and paste the different position in like so. And if you downloaded the code, you'll have this. Anyway, okay. So now into the move generation, and like I said, this is very, very simple. We're simply going to take the white pawn capture function and paste it and have an add black pawn capture. And now we're going to say, of course, a black pawn promotes when it's going from the second rank to the first. So we'll have to change this rank to two. And we'll change these pieces, the promotion pieces now, to black. And the same thing we'll do for writing a white pawn move. If it's going from the second rank, then it's promoting to a black piece. OK, so that part was fairly simple. And now we're going to do exactly the same thing as we did again in the previous video. We're just going to loop through the white pawns in the else here, which means that the side is black. So we need to look, make sure that we change this white pawn here and this one to a black pawn here. Now you probably already see that I don't usually like copying and pasting. Um, it makes for a bit of a quicker video which is why I'm doing it but when you start programming these things from scratch yourself copying and pasting things in and changing the odd value like this is usually the way to get something terribly wrong and it's better to type everything out but for brevity and because there's not much to change we'll go through it with some copy and pasting. So now we change simply the direction and say if we're going in the direction minus 10 is empty because of course black goes from top to bottom so it's going a minus 10 each time then we say that we will add a black pawn move in the minus 10 direction and if we're now starting from the seventh rank remember for black pawns and it can move two squares down so it's a pawn start move then we change this also to minus 20 we add another quiet move in here all well and good now let's take one of the captures in a diagonal direction and the first thing we'll change is that we're adding a black pawn capture and again we just simply change these directions square plus nine to square minus nine and one thing to be careful of is that we're now going to be capturing a white piece so we change the black to white there and I'll take this now and copy this in below and just change the minus nine to a minus eleven for the other directional uh, diagonal direction and that should be okay and last but not least is simply the en passant capture, which in a way is the simplest. We just simply need to make the pluses minuses because it's capturing again in the downwards direction. There's no color dependent stuff in here. So we'll hit save and that should be everything working okay. So if I type make, it doesn't. Why is it not? Oh, redefinition add white pawn move. I forgot to change the name of the function. Yes, I have. Sorry. It should be add black pawn move and you probably already spotted that yourself so I'll just hit make again and now type vice to run and you can see we generated 26 moves which was the same amount of moves as the position had when it was mirrored for white so it looks like everything is in working order and I'll just check it on the board here so we should have 12 moves for this pawn on g2 4 going to g1 yes 4 to h1 with a capture yes and 4 to f1 with a capture yes F4, F3 we have, F4, E3, B5, B4, B5, C4, yep, D5, D4, E4, and C4 is correct. H6, H5 is correct, and A7, A6, and A5, so it has C7, C6, uh, C7, C6, C6, C7, C5, sorry. And we've got E7, E6, and E7, A5. Good, so everything's looking relatively okay there, so that's the black pawn moves generated. In the next video, we'll look at generating the knight moves, and maybe I'll squeeze both colours at the same time in. Until then, thanks very much for watching, taking time to listen, comments, questions, criticisms, welcome as always on YouTube.